my goal with Get Your Game Tight right now is uh, basketball related. Um, I train, train the kids to try to uh, up the level, the skill level, the fundamentals. Prepping for the game is very important. It's almost as important as playing the game because uh, without the right preparation, you won't be able to play the game. You know, you uh, prone yourself to injuries. And so uh, it's very important that you stretch before the games and get loose, um, get your muscles going, get the blood flowing. Uh, it's very important. You know, it, it helps uh, minimize injuries. So stretching and prepping before the game is very important. Really depends on the kid. If he's hungry and he wanna really wanna learn how to play, then it's it's much easier. It's much easier for me to teach teach him moves and teach him how to shoot. Uh, whether they have the ability or not, uh, like like the way I've learned the game, basketball is 90% mental. It's only 10% physical. So if you want to be, if you want to play, if you're willing, there's something you can do in basketball. Whether it's rebounding, whether it's block shots, or playing defense, you know. So I feel like anybody could be capable of uh, playing basketball if they taught the right moves and taught the right things. Uh, these are game situation moves. Uh, I try to uh, get the kids' confidence to utilize these moves in the game and, and recognize, being able to recognize when to use the move in the game. But these, all the moves we use today can be used in the game. They're like game situation. That's what Get Your Game type is about, game situation. This is a spiritual, a spiritual Christian-based movement. As I move forward into into Him, so will get your game tight. To deal with a, a, a loss of a game or certain situations in the game, on and off the court, we try to build the kids up spiritually. Let them know that uh, God is real, and uh, He He's involved in everything, and He's He's in control all the time. Even when you think he's not in control, he's in control. So I try to uh, get the kids uplifted spiritually so that they will act accordingly off the court also because the way you carry yourself off the court is just as important as the way you carry yourself on the court. It affects the way you play. So you have to carry yourself accordingly.
when you're off the court? Just get to improve. It's fun. Get a, your coach is a former NBA player. That's really cool, too. It's just fun hanging out with everyone. I started playing about three and a half years ago, so not that long at all. I like, I like to lead, but it depends who's on the team. Like, I'm not just going to take a leader over and just, like, be that kind of guy who just wants to be the leader, but it's not. Uh, dribbling, I mean, I, I, my shot is still getting improved, but I really need to work on, like, finishing and stuff. Well, I can't improve on everything for sure, but, yeah, I want to make it to the NBA if I can. <laughs> uh, it's fun because I just get to work on my skills and keep getting better, you know, I really love it. Practicing dribbling or shooting skills. And also I have clothing. I have a clothing line. But uh, in the end, uh, Get Your Game Tight is going to be a ministry for me. It's going to turn into Get Your Game Tight with Christ. So that's where it's headed.